Welcome to SimpleKidsCrafts.com How to make those shoes using aluminum foil This video is part of a video series by Simple Kids Crafts Here I will show you how to make those shoes using different materials The objective of the video series is to make durable shoes that will not break easily and that can help your dolls stand on their own Press a piece of paper against your doll's foot Draw the shape of your doll's foot onto a piece of paper. Cut the shape out. You can also download the shapes of different feet for different dolls from our website simplekidscrafts.com. Cut a piece of aluminum foil that is three times as long and two times as wide as a footprint. Fold the aluminum foil until it's a tad bit bigger than the footprint. Shape the aluminum foil using the paper footprint as a guide. Then, press aluminum foil against your doll's foot to shape it. Repeat this process for the other foot. Cut small pieces of toilet paper. Mix equal parts of water and glue. Coat the aluminum foil footprint using a thin layer of paper and glue, both in the back and the front. Let it dry and repeat three more times to strengthen the material. Once dry, decide what you will be using as a heel. You can use a toothpick covered with aluminum foil, You can use beads and wire. You can also use a piece of hard plastic from a straw or a popsicle. Other options are toothpicks bunched together, barbecue sticks, glue sticks, wooden dowels, etc. Once you have placed the heel of your shoe, test that the shoe can stand on its own. At this point, you can paint the shoe, or you can wait until you have a design all done. Using the sole pattern, cut the sole of your shoes using glittery paper, foam, or fabric. Then, attach ribbon, string beads, elastic, wire, or whatever you want to keep the doll's foot in place. Place your doll's foot on the shoe and cut enough ribbon or material to go over and under your doll's foot. Glue the ribbon in place, then measure where the ribbon will go under the shoe's sole. Glue the sole on the side, Then glue the shoe. You can also attach additional ribbon to the side of the shoe to keep the shoe in place. Paint with acrylic paint or nail polish and decorate using glittery beads and stickers. Here are a few of the shoes I made today. I hope that they can serve as inspiration for you to make your own shoes at home.
Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video and don't forget to share, comment, rate, subscribe and keep on recycling. I'll see you on the next video. Bye!